Welcome back. There's a new feeling of optimism at Missouri Western. The football program has started 3-1 and one for the first time since 2015. It's quite the statement for first-year head coach Tyler Fenwick. The Griffins received three votes in the latest AFCA poll. They didn't make the top 25 in Division II, but if they are able to continue stacking wins, they'll be of greater consideration to make the cut. Jacob Michael looks back at their latest, latest win and how the Griffins are viewing the journey ahead. <laughs> It was never a matter of if Tyler Fenwick would get his first win, but when. Already in the month of September, this new regime has their first win with the program, and on Saturday they crossed off their first home win. It's all great accomplishments, but Fenwick is glad they can move on from it. I'm glad that all the first wins are over with, so we can just focus on winning football games. Obviously, to get your first win, that's a big deal, but, you know, let's let's not slow down. Let's, let's keep them coming. I think we're going in the upward motion. I don't see anything stopping us. We're building every day, stacking days, stacking reps. Before Saturday's home game against Fort Hay State, it was the offense of the Griffins making a name for themselves. They were the offense that was atop the MIAA heading into the game. Against the Tigers at Spratt, however, the offense did their part, but it was the pass rush and aggressiveness of the defense that gave Western the edge. It's a, it's a team. It's a total team game, and it's, you know, it might be a game where the offense has a huge day and 500 yards and the defense is struggling and, you know, whatever. And, and then, you know, the flip side of it is, you know, it's a day where the defense is going to have to, you know, pull their weight and, 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 and do their part and, and win a game for us. It's a vast difference between Saturday and their home opener on August 31st in a high scoring affair with Central Missouri. Week one, we weren't really too meshed together, but uh, that that really set us and let us know where we were at, how we could play. and that the difference between that week one game was maybe four or five plays. And so far we're getting those uh, corrections done, fixing those mistakes, and it's coming out on the positive side. The competition will get stiffer for Western and serve as an opportunity to further show the Griffin football program is a hotbed right now. They'll have number 11 Emporia State this upcoming Saturday at home. Two weeks from then, they'll host Northwest Missouri State. And two weeks from that game, it's number three Pitt State at Spratt Stadium. Jacob Michael. News Press Now Sports.